materials are everywhere. From the simple objects in our day-to-day -day lives to the technology and infrastructure that we rely on, we are surrounded by goods and equipment that lean on decades, if not centuries, of innovative materials choices. To shape the world of tomorrow, engineering and design students need to understand the vast universe of materials available today and learn how to choose between them wisely. ANSYS Grant to EDUPAC is a unique set of teaching resources to support materials education. It provides educators with a comprehensive database of materials and process information and powerful materials visualization and selection tools. EDUPAC's data sheets cover all material families, as well as joining, shaping, and surface treatment processes. And they include visual references for introductory courses, plus science notes that stimulate students' curiosity and encourage self-learning by exploring the world of engineering materials and industrial processes. These are available in three levels, increasing in complexity and depth of data so that students access a suitable level of materials information as they progress through their studies. Selecting the correct material for any given design is a key ability. Students require an awareness of available materials, their properties, and how to choose between them. EDUPAC comes with a full suite of selection tools to integrate systematic material selection at all levels of the curriculum. Education resources, such as lecture units, worked examples, and industry-relevant case studies support multiple approaches to materials teaching. EDUPAC is designed for students in any discipline, from their first introduction to materials through to the choice of optimal materials in their final design projects. It is perfectly suited for capstone projects to investigate the environmental impact of a product and to explore alternatives in design loops using its materials data in other simulation software. ANSYS Grant to EDUPAC, inspiring students to design the future.